Thank you very much. Want to head over uh, just down the street here uh, into the Forks with a brand new restaurant, Smith, where our buddy Drew Kozub is. And Drew, we learned that the name comes from uh, a Smith, a craftsperson, and then we've seen some amazing exa examples of the craftsmen and craftswomen that work at Smith. That is just exactly it. It truly is a craft making food on this caliber and uh, very evident from the things that we saw. As you remember, uh, this morning we started off uh, actually at the, at the bar with some cocktails. And when you look at the cocktail menu and you see things like an absinthe rinsed glass or flaming fruit, you know that you're in for something pretty spectacular. Yeah, no. yeah and the smoked ice. Smoked ice, don't forget the impossible. <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah. And, and we carried on from there, um, trying out some of those appetizers, um, starting with the, uh, we had the, the olives that were stuffed with this delicious, uh, this delicious sausage made fresh in-house. We had their, their, peanut, uh, their, their nut bowl, which had a whole bunch of different kinds of nuts, like cashews and, and pistachios and, and walnuts all mixed in there with this like spicy like chili stuff using real chilies and, and syrup to bind it all together, so delicious. So that really set the tone for things. So we've been building, getting better, getting better, getting bigger. We uh -huh. tried their, their breakfast hash mixture with the corned beef and the beets. And guys, I'm, I'm getting pumped because <laughs> now we get to show you what is like a work of art. I'm not gonna do the honors myself. In order to do this, there has to be somebody worthy of this culinary caliber and I can't think of anyone better mm -hmm. than Chef Alex Van, the chef here at Smith. Good morning, one more time, Chef Good Alex. Good morning, yes. What do we call this wonderful splendor of delicious food that you have before us? We just call it our, our boards. Our and, boards? And uh, basically anything you want in the menu, you can get, put on a big slab of, uh, of, of wood that a local guy made from uh, reclaimed wood. Um, and, and it's a great way of try lots of different things and share it all. So I can give you the grand yeah, tour please, of this place please, here. Please take, some, take your time so, and go a little around here. We'll start here with the mac and cheese. So it's uh, uh, mac and cheese made with our own house cottage cheese and mm -hmm. Bothwell Old Cheddar and the topping is a bacon and blue cheese crumb. Oh my gosh. Um, here we have our house made uh, kubasa. So we make it in house using uh, local Brookshire pork. Um, our own house sauerkraut and this is our own uh, house made beer mustard. And you guys are doing like the, the beer mustard and stuff, those condiments and stuff. You guys are doing all that stuff in house all as made well, in right? House. All made in that house. That is so much work. Um, we if just we get can to, make it, we will. So We just get to kick back and enjoy this stuff. Yeah. And I know that you mentioned um, that your Kubasa is, uh, um, could be the very best in the city. And that reminded me, I can't remember who I was talking with, but someone who was dining here just this past weekend said the exact same thing. You know, people will all talk about you know, the best Kubasa in Winnipeg and where does it come from, this place, that place. I'm pretty bold saying it's ours. Well, um, so I'm sure I'll get a lot of hate mail because of that, but best kubasa in the city. People are gonna have to come down and try it themselves. Okay, I'm sorry, continue the tour here. Uh, classic rack of lamb done with a little mustard and a sort of herb Provence kind of crust. Okay. Um, Sauteed garlic mushrooms, super simple. Mushrooms, white wine, garlic butter. Um, then we have our Berkshire pork wrap. Berkshire pork wrap, So that eh? comes from uh, the pigs that we bring in. Uh, it's a big, 20 ounce piece of uh, beautiful, delicious Berkshire pork with an apple, fennel, and date compote. Oh my gosh. And then we have uh, sour cream and chive mashed potatoes. This is our baked bean dish. So beans we uh, braise with uh, smoked pork hocks. Uh -huh. And uh, we put a little creme crust in there, so it's almost like a little mini cassoulet. And then here we have our uh, 20 ounce rib steak, uh, grilled up the way you oh. like it with a nice slab of bone marrow butter. Oh my gosh, that is unreal. Um, everything on here looks so good, and I guess the idea here is we want to be able to try as many things as possible, so the emphasis really is on that, that family-style serving, right? Yeah, exactly. I mean, people have gotten used to ordering, I think, appetizers that way, like going for tapas or whatever, and, and sharing all the apps, but the, the trend with dinner is to have your own little plate, right? Mm -hmm. But whenever I order, I always order last to see what everyone else is having, so I get what they didn't order. And so this way, if, if you want the lamb, I want the pork, you want the chicken, we order it all, we all get to try it. So it's not, you know, you don't feel left out. So that's the way we get uh, the most out of our experience at Smith. Yeah. Going with a good group, everyone picks something different, everyone's sharing. It's family style dining, hey? It's perfect family style dining. Uh, Chef Alex, I um, absolutely love what you've been doing here at Smith and so excited that now the doors are open and everyone can come check it out. Thank you for letting us come down here today. Thanks for coming. Thanks for. Uh visiting us here. Well, uh, just a spectacular culinary experience. Please do not miss out on this and get down here as soon as possible. Smith is the new restaurant at Inn at the Forks. If you want to connect with these guys to come down here, find out some more information, you'll find that information on the BT website at breakfasttelevision.ca. We're going to take a little break and then we'll catch up with you one more time before the end of the show. Come on, come on, come on, dance,